Hi Descendants, welcome to another video. Today I'm going to give you the Dojo Weekly Grinding Report for the first Descendant. This is a video where I will be sharing best places you should grind, the reactors you should be looking for, and general tips for the week. Also, I'm super hyped because Season 1 is around the corner and we have a lot of things to talk about. Now, let's get straight to the Weekly Report and if you do enjoy this type of videos, make sure you like that video and maybe I've earned your subscription. If you did subscribe, thank you very much. I like you. All right, let's talk business. Here, here are the top four reactors that I would go for this week. And let's talk about each one separately. Number one, now Glay, we are super lucky because I'm still hunting for a perfect Glay reactor. I still don't have one. And let's talk about the Glay reactor for a second. So in this week, you can go in Echo Swamp and you can grind this mission over and over again if you very have a quick bunny. Uh, or you have a group uh, with your friends that you would like to go and grind there. This is a super quick mission. I highly, highly recommend you guys go there and grind for some general rounds dimension, uh, non-attribute reactors, because those are good for Vobby and for Jaber as well. Now, when we talk about the Glade reactor, what you want to do and look for is two weapon mountings are ideal. One of them is going to be Python. The other one is going to be Thunder Cage. And the stats that you should be looking for is skill cooldown, skill duration, damage against colossus if you get any of these stats go for it the most important one is going to be skill cooldown so make sure to always check if you get a yellow roll skill cooldown the best place where you can grind this is going to be in the environmental contamination zone this is a very amazing mission i really really recommend you guys go and check it out all right the second descendant that is getting some love in terms of reactor drops this week this is going to be freyna for freyna you can go for a general rounds uh, tech reactor that is also best in slot for her i would go for either fallen hope or thunder cage i will go for fallen hope reactors um because i feel like that's the best mobbing weapon for freyna the, the the stats that i would go for are gonna be skill cooldown duration toxic damage and etc maybe tech damage if if i get a combination of um, reactors like that the best place is you you can actually go for two different you know, rotations you can do the outpost with the vobby if you will uh, but but you could also do kuiper mine i do actually do kuiper mine a little bit differently i don't do the vobby run in there anymore i actually have way more fun doing it with jaber and jaber is a very cool and chill semi afk way of getting this mission done if you're interested in the entry and beginner friendly jaber build to do this kuiper mine mission check out this video over here and yeah the other descendant that is getting some lucky drops this week is going to be for blair and also super convenient because blair is getting buffed in season one you're looking for dimension uh focused reactors and these you can find in the classified area in more particular it is going to be large nuclear reactor mission this is a very popular mission it was one of the first uh, spots where you can actually do a lot of uh, kuiper and gold and stuff like this now you can really run this mission over and over again um however i would also combine it with you know you do the mission you go clear the outpost because it's right next to the to the mission so do both things the outpost is actually a really popular one because there you can get uh, pretty popular and very good uh, blueprints from those amorphous materials so go and grind your blair reactors over there the next descendants that also has a possibility to get good reactors this week is going to be bunny if you still look for your singular reactor for your bunny now is the time there is one downside about this reactor obviously it's going to be in a not very convenient mission but it is what it is if you still need this reactor i guess you have to go and grind over there pay attention to the stats uh to make sure you get a reactor for thunder cage with singular damage electric skill damage is also appreciated and skill cost is also very good for bunny so this is what this week has to offer this is the mission i recommend snowy heights if you did enjoy this video make sure you hit that like button and maybe even subscribe to my channel i'd really appreciate it and we're also growing our discord we're above 600 members right now if you're looking for a community to join to run bosses with look for people to hang out with on voice check out our discord i'll see you there